Hey what is up guys I am Rahul and today for you I'm going to be showing you the Battlefield 4 text effect in Photoshop just like this and there's a download link in the description just for you guys so you guys can go and download it. What you're going to get is this file and as you can see this text here is um, changeable and I will just show you how I did it in a second but for you guys that don't really care and you just want to have the text for all your like edits and stuff or your background or whatnot you can just download this change the text move it into your own um, file so say you had a file open just like uh, oh wait just like um, you had a file open like one second like this say you had a file open like this then what you can do is you just right click on the text uh, duplicate layer and then put it into your new file and then once it's in there you'll be able to change it and everything so that's pretty cool anyway how I actually did it if you guys are still watching is as you can see here well I've basically just got the text and the actual font I used was agency FB it's a free font you can probably get it off dafont.com or one of your own font websites and then you just um, go into the effects and change the effects the whole kind of thing was to do with patterns but there are also many other things in there for instance with the stroke we've got the pattern here this pattern you can probably copy yourself but um it was quite hard I had I, what I kind of did was I just went on the actual battlefield um, logo or well, text and I kind of um, just copy and pasted the pattern and I got it here so um that's how it is um you don't really want to be changing any of these settings unless you like change the text size then you want to change the size of the stroke just to um make it the right size basically what the stroke is is this darker bluish kind of thing on the text so um that you can change then we've got the color overlay um kind of a bluish tone um, I, it just um gives a little tone to the um text gradient Overlay is a uh, like um, the same kind of thing, the bluish, but it fades out to a transparent color. So there, um, it kind of goes in, and you can kind of see it. As you can see, it's blue at the top, then goes down to the whitish, and that's um, pretty good because that kind of looks how the battle that looks like how the battlefield vortex looks like. Then we've got another pattern. This is for the actual text. That kind of um, bumpy text that you get without this pattern if you look it's um just pretty much plain and it looks all right but um i think with it it just looks better but you can choose which ones you want on and off and then finally we got the outer glow which just gives it that like, kind of like blue glowish feel um without it as you can see it just doesn't look as good but with it it looks really good so um you guys can choose like i said any of these on or off the download is in the description media file media fire you should just download this um file and get it yourself next up in um in the next video kind of like this i will be showing you how to do the china rising effect china rising one is much more easier you guys can do it yourself so yeah download link like i said will be in the description hopefully you guys have enjoyed this video if you did please leave a like as it helped me out a lot subscribe as well because um if you don't want to miss out on the china rising and maybe tell your friends and stuff because I know lots of people have been looking for something like this and we've finally got it now so you guys can go and have fun with it. Anyway guys, I'm Ibrahul. Hopefully you guys have enjoyed this video and I'll catch you in the next.